Here's a 1936 Ford five window coupe that is absolutely beautiful. This car had original 22,000 miles on it when it was then disassembled and put back to the way that you see it today. Um, it was finished just in time to go to the early Ford V8 Club Grand National Meet. So it was just finished this past June. At that Grand National Meet, this car scored 998 points out of 1,000. So um, it's in near perfect shape, um, if not perfect shape. Uh, if you'd like to see a copy of the judging form, we do have a copy available upon request. There is the original 21 stud flathead motor underneath the hood. And it does have the correct aluminum heads, and that has also been overhauled. It's riding on the correct Firestone double white walls. As you can see, it has the artillery wheels. Uh, the cool thing about those is it has what's called the spider caps, I believe it is. So that chrome cap goes all the way down out, all the way to the edge of the artillery wheel there. That was an accessory from Ford. The interior came from the well-respected LeBaron Bonnie. So if you're familiar with interiors, convertible tops, you know that is quality. The other thing, the dash around the windows, and I'll get on the other side so you can see it better also. Uh, that's late pr production uh, wood grain dash with the window garnish and moldings. Um, very, very nice. It's just like new. Chrome and bright work, all beautiful in this car. The, the paint is called Coach Maroon, which would have been a factory color from Ford in 1936. Just can't say enough about this car. How nice it is. It does look as good in person as it does in the videos and the pictures. And then with that judging sheet, you can buy with confidence on this one. There's the uh, banjo steering wheel. Like I said, that uh, late production wood grain dash, the brown face gauges. Speedometer was rebuilt. There's not the correct miles on it. It actually has less than that. It was changed when it was rebuilt. This also has a two-speed Columbia rear end, which, and it still has the original brackets, original apparatus as far as mechanical and running it. So that's there. That's what that is, three-speed manual transmission. As you can see in the rear, it does have the rear roll-down window. Also in the trunk, you can take a look at the still pictures. You'll see the trunk engine bay. Those can be seen at unique classic cars. In the trunk, there's a complete set of correct tools for it. Let me go ahead and fire this up so you can hear it run. Click the ignition on. Starter's down on the floor here. I don't think we're gonna choke it too much since we're indoors. Make sure we're in neutral. That's how easily and how nicely that flat head fires up. I had given it just a tad of choke. We'll put it in just a little bit. Here how smooth and nicely that overhauled flat head V8 runs. Nicely that door closes. The fit and finish of it, just unbelievable. Come around back so you can hear it. Very cool sounding engines, that flathead V8. So if you'd like to know more about this vehicle, feel free to give us a call. 507-386-1726. You can check out all the still pictures and everything can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com. Absolutely incredible. 1936 Ford. Five window coupe, fully restored.